the first analyst to follow Bitcoin sees a very accessible way to track its next big move. DataTrack Research's co-founder, Nick Colas, said recently that the key is looking into Google search and wallet growth. By looking at the number of people who search for the word Bitcoin on Google, which has roughly a 60% market share of search globally, we get a pretty good sense of where the interest is, he told CNBC's Trading Nation this week. The data does show exactly the same price trends that we saw for the past 90 days, he added. And, just like the latest search trends, the cryptocurrency's price has been deep in the doldrums. It's been trading in the $10,000 to $12,000 range, off sharply from its record price near $20,000 it hit in December. Bitcoin searches have really trailed off. So, the interest levels definitely show you where Bitcoin has these big breakouts and then pullbacks, said Colas. He points to more evidence to support his theory to the Bitcoin boom between last Thanksgiving and December 17, when search traffic saw a significant pickup as Bitcoin prices surged to a record at $19,843. Search trends skyrocketed after Thanksgiving here in the US in November of last year, more than doubling in the course of just a couple of weeks added Colas. That incremental search for the term Bitcoin actually led to an incremental number of wallets being formed, a method by which people hold Bitcoin. But days later, Bitcoin prices crashed, and so did searches for it. Despite Bitcoin's troubles, Colas, who owns a quarter of a Bitcoin, doesn't think it needs a life raft. He points out that it's still trading higher than before Thanksgiving, and the technology makes a lot of sense long term. From this point on, we just have to look for the beginnings of good news that will reaccelerate wallet growth to make the thing go higher, Colas said.